My name is Theta Gibbs Gray, and I'm an assistant professor of reading at Ohio University. In Sipping Tea, two Black female literacy scholars sharing counter stories to redefine our roles in the academy was written in partnership with my sister scholar, Bonnie Williams Ferrier, who is an assistant professor of English, comparative literature, and linguistics at Cal State Fullerton. Sipping tea refers to a concept that's often conceptualized in popular media that stereotypically frames conversations between Black women as gossip and unimportant. However, we counter these notions in our article by demonstrating the significance of communal conversations, not only in the Black community, but among Black women. We center our article on several phone conversations between Bonnie and I. Through multiple conversations, we were able to share the triumphs of our experiences as Black female literacy scholars and also the challenges. We transferred these conversations into a dialogic performance of the two of us sipping tea surrounding our experiences as Black female literacy scholars in a coffee shop during the 2016 Literacy Research Association session for Star Fellows. This dialogic performance serves as our analytical centerpiece. It was paramount to our article to utilize theoretical frameworks that centered the importance of a race and gender and critical race theory and Afrocentric feminist epistemology provide this theoretical framing. Critical race theory rests upon multiple tenets, but throughout our piece, we illuminate the ways that race and racism pervade our institutions just as they do in society. We also acknowledge the significance of the type of counter narratives or first person accounts of our experiences. Patricia Hill Collins Afrocentric Feminist Epistemology is now a long-standing tradition of Black feminist thought that explicitly challenges the dominant forms of knowledge production in the academy. We reclaim this framework because it applies specifically to the experience of Black women scholars in the academy and our continuing struggle to secure safe spaces that allow us to tell and validate our stories to and for each other. The rich body of research that we draw upon in our article speaks to the historical and contemporary experiences of Black women faculty in literacy and other academic disciplines. This research speaks to the ways that racism and sexism influence how Black women scholars are often positioned within the academy. It also speaks to the forms of integral support that help Black women scholars to survive and succeed. This piece is meant to inform, affirm, enliven, and institute positive change. It is meant to enliven a commitment to ensuring that as should be the case for all faculty, institutions are committed to recruiting, retaining, and supporting the success of Black female scholars. It is also meant to affirm our humanity as people, women, Black women, and Black women who are literacy scholars. This affirmation now only provides the fuel for us to be our best selves as faculty researchers and educators, but also for all women of color faculty and for Black women faculty.